really horrifying and to think that somebody just left her on the street to die. Right now at 11, heartbreak and pain. A woman prays her 85-year-old mother will recover after she was badly hurt in a hit and run crash in Center City, Philadelphia. Good evening, I'm Joe Holden. The grandmother of seven, a former college professor, was struck yesterday crossing the street at 21st and Chestnut. The driver kept on going. Jasmine Payute live at the scene with an exclusive interview with the victim's daughter as police continue to search for that driver. Jasmine, good evening. Good evening, Joe. The family says they've heard of incidents like these happening around the city, but never imagined it would happen to them. Now they're asking people to slow down as the search continues for that driver. The thought of just a car hitting my mom's body is horrifying. I can't. I think about it and I just have a nightmare for her. For Nancy Brudum, her nightmare on earth happened in broad daylight Friday afternoon. That's when her mother, Andre Bruto, was struck and critically injured. I can't wrap my brain around that. I can't understand how somebody could go so fast and create such damage. Surveillance video given to only eyewitness news shows the moments the 85-year-old grandmother of seven was crossing the street at the intersection of Chestnut and 21st Streets. She only makes it a few steps off the sidewalk when a vehicle turning left hits her, then flees the scene. We froze it before the impact. How could you do this to her? How could you do this? And, and how could you not have stopped? Because you knew that you, you hit her. Nancy says her mother, who was once a college professor, lived in Center City with her husband Solomon. She was headed to pick up an order of sushi when it happened. She's such a strong, dynamic, vibrant person. And to see her in a hospital bed without being able to open her eyes, Again, it's just, it's unfathomable. It's a bad scenario. Nancy says could have been worse if it wasn't for this. Onlookers who never met her mother stopping what they were doing and jumping in to help. No words of gratitude able to express her appreciation. I'm so grateful for the people who were there, who helped her, who stopped traffic, who got to her quickly, who called 911 and, and who took care of her because it's the speed of response that's giving us a chance here. That family now needs your help. They're asking anyone with information to contact police. We're live in Center City. Jasmine Payute, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Jasmine.